It's been more than two years since the Xbox Series X and Xbox Series S came out. Generally speaking, they are exactly what Microsoft promised they would be. The Series X is a pricey powerhouse, delivering top-of-the-line performance in a black, boxy chassis. The Series S, on the other hand, is more limited in scope although its compact size and cheaper price are definite points in its favor. In any case, if you're in the market for a new Xbox console, you have two choices. To spare you the suspense, the Xbox Series X is the better console of the two, with better specs, better performance and better prospects for the future. The question, however, isn't which console is better, it's which console is better for you? While the Xbox Series X is the way to go if you've got money to spend and a 4K HDR TV to show off, the Series S is not without its charms. Watch on to find out how the two systems stack up and how you could find a spot for one or both in your home. Price, the Xbox Series S price is one of only a few categories in which it definitely beats the Xbox Series X. Simply put, the Xbox Series S costs $300, whereas the Series X costs $500. Prices vary from country to country, but the differential is similar. Performance, whereas the Xbox Series S has a clear price advantage, the Xbox Series X has a clear hardware advantage. While the two systems have the same CPU, they have different storage and RAM capacities. There's also a significant difference in the two consoles' GPU. Design While the Xbox Series X is a pretty console, there's no denying that it's pretty big. 11.9x 5.9x 5.9 inches and 9.8 pounds. It's not at all guaranteed to fit in your entertainment center particularly if you want it in a horizontal configuration. This is where the Xbox Series S positively shines. The low white console with the tasteful black vents on top is only 10.8x 5.9x 2.6 inches and 4.3 pounds. It's one of the smallest, lightest consoles in years, and it fits perfectly in an entertainment center or simply next to a TV on a dresser. The Xbox Series S is easy to fit into any setup and easy to move around. What's the same? In many ways, the Xbox Series X and Xbox Series S are very similar. Sure, their overall power and design is different, but both use the same controller, interface, and other features. Most pertinent, the game library is the same for both. Sure, you'll get better graphics and faster frame rates in the latest games with the Series X, but the Series S isn't likely to let you down either. There are a lot of older Xbox games now optimized for both of the new consoles and also run well on each. Both consoles can also use the Xbox's signature quick resume feature which lets you suspend multiple games and pick up right where you left off in each one. Xbox Series X vs Xbox Series S Overview There's no denying that the Xbox Series X is the more powerful of the two systems and the better investment, if you can afford it. However, there are a few circumstances under which an Xbox Series S might still be a smart buy. The secondary console case described above carries some weight. If you have a 1080 TV and no plans to upgrade anytime soon, the Series S is the way to go and when you do get a 4K TV, it'll still be a good stopgap system thanks to upscaling. We are going to end this video right away. If you have any query or information to share, please leave a comment below. Thanks for watching.